What's going on guys and girls? In today's video, I'll be going over one of the latest features to be released by ChatGPT, and this is called Custom Instructions. So Custom Instructions allows you to give more in-depth instructions to ChatGPT, and it will be able to follow those instructions to give you better outputs. So in today's video, I'll be showing you a couple of different use cases that you can use to help you write better content using the Custom Instructions tab on ChatGPT. In order to access custom instructions, head over to your profile and you'll be able to see the custom instructions tab. And this is where you'll be able to fine tune or give more in-depth um, instructions to ChatGPT. So instead of just prompting the AI on the chat box, like you usually would, you'd be able to add custom instructions. And this would allow you to steer the AI much better and allow the AI to follow instructions much clearer. The first way that I use custom instructions was to write more SEO optimized content. So I wanted to write an article about how to build your credit score. So instead of including those keywords into the um, chat box, I went ahead and included that within the custom instructions tab. So these are the H1 key terms that you need to include within the article. Below that, we have the H2 and below that, we have the terms within the articles. And we were able to grab all of this content from Neuron Writer. So Neuron Writer um, is a content optimization tool. What we did was we copied over the um, terms in articles and the terms in headers and again we pasted that into chat gpt so what i did was i then told it that we need to use this information below to write an seo optimized article on how to build your credit score so that was the instructions that i gave and this was the full article that we got back so again i gave it the instructions to write the seo optimized outline first so we created an outline about how to build your credit and then it was able to write a full article on that topic. So after the content was written with ChatGPT, I went ahead and optimized it using New and Writer. And as you can see, we were able to get a score of 62 out of 100 for the blog post on how to build your credit score. So as you can see here, you are able to get a pretty high um, content optimization score. When I first pasted in the content, it was about 40 or 45, and I had to add in a title and a meta tag, and I had to optimize some of the H1 and H2 tags. But again, you are able to get fairly optimized content by using the custom instructions. So that's one way in which you can use custom instructions for SEO. The second way is to use a prompt like this. So the prompt is you're an expert blog post writer. You specialize in writing SEO optimized blog posts that rank on Google and outranks competitors. When writing the article, everything you do should be to rank on the first page of Google for the keyword and you can enter whatever keyword you would like to enter here. So make sure that you are naturally including this target keyword and variations of this keyword throughout the article. Also think about what best SEO practices you need to follow and what SEO optimized outline you need to include to write an SEO optimized article to rank for this keyword. So again, what we're telling the AI here is just you need to essentially do everything you can to outrank competitors and rank for the keyword in which we enter. And this is really effective because the AI is going to continually think about this instruction and write content geared towards the instructions that you entered within the section here. So it's a little bit better than prompting because sometimes AIs can forget the prompts in which you give them. But with custom instructions, I find that the AI is able to follow the instructions for much longer. And this was the content that we got back from ChatGPT about how to become a better leader as a CEO. And we got a score of 57 out of 100. And um, of course, once you go ahead and actually do some manual optimization, like including some of the H1 terms, some of the H2 terms, you can definitely get a 65 or 70 um, score for your content optimization. You could also use custom instructions to tell ChatGPT to write in your own specific brand writing style. So if you're writing for a company, if you're writing for your own brand and you have a specific way that you write, whether it be the tone, the audience, or um, just any specifics about how you write, you can include that within your custom instructions to let ChatGPT know to write in this style always. So for example, let's say you're writing for a company and they have very specific instructions on things that you can include and not include when you're writing for them. This company here has a very long list of things that you need to include and not include while writing for them. So what you can do is we can go ahead and we can copy all of this content here and we can tell the AI to um, follow these instructions when writing all content. And again, this is better than prompting because I feel as though the custom instructions um, allows the AI to really steer it in the direction that you would like it to go. And it's able to listen to instructions a lot um, longer compared to prompting because sometimes AIs can forget the prompts that you give them. So let's go ahead and copy over this brand writing guy here and we're going to paste it into the custom instructions tab. The only drawback with custom instructions is that you don't really have that many words in which you can play with. So if you go over your limit, you can go ahead and use ChatGPT and we can tell it to summarize this or concise this text so it's a little bit shorter. And once you have the concise 
writing style, you can then go ahead and update that within your custom instructions. So let's go ahead and remove this. I'm going to paste in the new custom instructions and we're going to tell the AI when writing any sort of content, make sure to always include the following writing style in instructions below. And then we have the instructions and the writing style below. So this is going to be very, very useful for you because you don't have to necessarily always continually to tell the AI or to prompt it. You can just have this as your custom instructions and then continue writing as much content as you need, especially for writing for um, different clients. It makes it very easy for you to have those writing styles. Um, for your specific clients, you can always go ahead and change that when you're writing for a new client. And lastly, you can use custom instructions to reduce your AI detection. Words at Scale did a really good video on using the custom instructions tab to write content that was not easily detectable by originality.ai. So if you want to check out that full video to see exactly what he did, I'll leave a link in the description below because he does a really good job at explaining and creating a prompt to help you reduce AI detection. So those are some of the ways currently that I am using custom instructions. Let me know in the comments below if there's any other use cases that you've been using that's really, really effective. As always, I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video and I hope that you learned something new. If you did, let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Until next time, stay well.